Welcome to the Dentamax Tip of the Week. Today, I'm going to be discussing with you our new web kiosk for new patient registration. Today, I'm gonna do a walkthrough so you can see just how easy it can be for your patients to fill out their new patient paperwork online before they even make it to your office. Today, I'm going to be acting as our patient, Courtney Walter, right here. To get started, all I'll have to do is pull up my web browser, and I already have the website up that I'm going to be filling out paperwork for, and and simply enter my password. When the patient begins filling out their paperwork, they will get this screen and simply work through the different fields. So I said I'm going to be Courtney Walter today. And anything that is entered here is going to be entered into the Dentamax software when you merge the fields. This is going to save you quite a bit of time with your data entry. You'll notice we have some fields that are grayed in. Those fields are what we call the required field. So this is exactly the same information they would fill out on the in-office kiosk, the difference is that this is going to be for new patients only. And again, this is online without them even being into your office yet. So it makes it easier for yourself and your patient. You can now verify any information ahead of time so that you have their insurance ready to rock and roll as soon as they come through the door. And with the conditions and alerts, we have this awesome no to all button, which is another quick button built in just to help your patient get through this a little bit faster. And if there are some yeses, they can simply come through and change the no's to yes. Saving them quite a bit of time from having to go through and check no to every single one. All right, they can enter previous dentist information. as much as they know. As soon as the patient hits submit, the paperwork has been sent electronically to you in the dental office. All you will have to do is pull up our manager here and see that Courtney Walter does have some paperwork that's ready to save. I can simply come over to Courtney, create the patient file. Without filling out any additional information, I can then go ahead down to my manager and save to Dentamax and it pulls up my patient here because it's the only Courtney Walter I have in my software. And we are going to use the selected patient. And then it's gonna pull over all the information. It's gonna show me what I have existing for Courtney, and then it's gonna show me what we entered for Courtney. If you don't like or accept some of the answers she's gave here, or you have questions on it, for instance, this phone number perhaps, you could choose to accept all, accept this one particular one, and that'll allow you to get the corrected information from your patient. I'm gonna hit next. All right, so just come on through and take a look at everything that the patient filled out. And as we go through here, you're just gonna wanna review the information that was entered for the patient, skim through, and you can always hit accept all next and again just make sure you review the information it highlights in yellow what the patient has responded yes to okay 
way and it shows you that she signed all the required paperwork that you loaded and that these are going to be imported into her document center and then you want to click update Dentamax down here it tells you that it was completed we can jump back to the scheduler now and we have Courtney Walter and I can open her up here and we get all of that information pulled over into her information screen here. All right. This has been the Dentamax Tip of the Week. If you have questions, please give us a call 1-800-704-8494 and dial 2 for training or email training at dentamax.com. Thank you so much. Have a great day.